The two women charged in connection with a stabbing at Bentley University early Wednesday morning are being held without bail. Sarah Monta, 19, of Cranston, Rhode Island, and Brianne Fraser, 22, of Danvers, have been charged with armed robbery and assault and battery with a dangerous weapon. Neither are students at the university. Around 3.30 a.m. Wednesday, the pair arrived at the Fenway Residence Hall to see 21-year-old student Rafael Peña. One of his sweetmates later told police he heard a loud altercation. After what appears to be a prostitution deal gone wrong, one of the girls stabbed Peña in the upper chest. Peña told police the pair fled after stealing $300. Bentley police, who were aware of the suspect's descriptions and vehicle, apprehended them in a visitor parking lot before they could flee. Fraser told arresting officers that she was offered $50 to perform oral sex by Peña, but refused. Pena was rushed to hospital with non-life-threatening injuries and later released. Bentley officials say he has returned to his family. At their arraignment Wednesday in Waltham District Court, Fraser and Monta pleaded not guilty, covering their faces with their hair and evading photographers. On February 10th, both will face additional hearings to determine their dangerousness and whether bail should be revoked in a January 6th incident in Boston. According to newspaper reports, both women have been arrested on other prostitution and robbery charges. Among the items confiscated as evidence in the Bentley incident were a promise to appear notice from a Boston municipal court, prescription pills, nine condoms, and lubricant jelly. In a series of statements, university officials have underscored that the suspects and victim knew one another and that the campus is safe and building secure. For Waltham Newswatch, this is Chris Wangler.